How are you, Henry? Right? God's the sake, boy from Henry. college? Is there someone here who trades in goods? I don't know. All the Tomburgers fled from the village, so it won't be easy to find anyone. When I want something, I go to the local pond keeper. He can usually get you anything you care to think of. He's over by the granary. But if it's food you want, you're better off going to the cook. She's more pleasant to deal with. You're the young fellow who came here from Skull. It's half dead, aren't you? Henry, yes, that'll be can. me. Why? The lady of the castle was asking after you. She wants to talk to you. Ah, I'll go and see her then. Thank you. Very well. Don't make her wait. How are you, Henry? The Lord Good watch day, over Henry. you, Henry. Greetings, Henry. Greetings. What do you need? Welcome, Sir Radzik Henry. sent me with an important message. He asked for reinforcements. He needs more men? What's going on? Henry, the bandits and Cumans have set up camp in Pribislavitz. They're preparing for something. Sir Radzik wants to mount an assault on them, but he doesn't have enough men. Hang on. Easy now. From the beginning. What happened? I managed to track down the camp of the bandits who raided Neuhof. But it's not just a gang of brigands. More like a small army in a fortified encampment. I don't know what they're up to. But I'm sure they're getting ready for something. You, and Sir Radzig wants to destroy them before they get a chance. So it's worse than I thought. But Sir Radzig is right. We should do something about them before it's too late. I'll send my soldiers. Sir Radzig said to take all your men God's and leave only a minimum guard at the castle. What? Everyone? There really are a lot of them, Sir Divish. He's leaving the camp almost you, empty, Henry. too. We're to go and join his people in Pribislavitz and mount an assault together. All right then. Sir Radzig knows what the he's Lord doing. Watch over you, I'll Henry. muster the men and send them with Captain Robard in command. Would you lead my men there right now? Welcome, yes, Henry. Yes, sir. May God be with you in battle. Sir Radzig. I'm glad to see you, Captain Robard. I hope Henry's explained everything to you. He did, but I find it hard to believe. Who could possibly put together such a significant military force, and right under our noses? We'll just have to find out, but I don't think we will until after a battle. If we don't deal with them now, who knows what they'll be capable of in a week or two. I agree entirely, my lord. What's the plan? Right, lad. We're almost at the place you described. Now we'll have to advance cautiously. 
I need you to tell me how it looks around the camp so I can decide which side to lead the attack from. Sir, that's a big responsibility. I don't think I should... I asked you a question, boy. You've been there and seen everything, so speak up. There are three ways to get in. Directly along the straight path to the camp, the long way round through the woods and over an old weir, or by a narrow bridge over a deep ditch. Let's start with the direct route. That sounds like the easiest approach. How does it look there? That path leads round their battlements. It's fortified and patrolled. The chances are they'd shower us with arrows on the way. It's a good thing you're here, Henry. We'll have to try another way, then. What about the approach through the woods and the weir? I don't like the idea of marching such a long way over rough ground, but if it's the better option... It's a long way through the woods, and there are patrols there as well. They'll call the alarm before we reach the camp. I thought so. What about the last approach, over the bridge? It's a bit narrow for my liking. It's narrow, all right, but once we get over, we can quickly occupy the best ground for a battle. We only have to take down a few archers. The battleground sounds inviting, but that bridge and the archers... It's not an easy decision. Each option has its pros and cons. I try to answer to the best of my ability, sir. And you'll be suitably rewarded for your efforts. From what you say, the route over the bridge is the best option. If we're fast, we'll have the advantage. With the help of God, we'll win this day. We'll approach from the south and storm them over the bridge. Form up. Forward march. Let's go! To the bridge, quickly! Get to the other side, as many of you as possible! And hold your position there! Some of you take the left flank. We'll attack in two places at once. Yeah. <sighs> 
gun! Alright, man! The way's clear! Up and up! up. Deal with those archers before we're all shot! and smash down that gate! Stick together and hold the line! Hold your ground!
And you go out, you dogs! Drive them back! <laughs> I will cleave you in two, you bastard. You tried before. Yet here I am. What? Who the hell are you? You don't remember me? I remember you, though. And where's my fucking sword? What the fuck are you on about? What's... Hang on. You're the... Fuck me. I thought we left you to the crows. Tough little fucker, eh? What did you do with my sword? Judging by our last encounter, I'd say you made a big mistake coming here. Where's my fucking sword? But then again, maybe you've had some practice. I hope so. Because last time was too easy. My sword. What have you done with it? <laughs> Talk, you bastard! I'll see you in hell. Tell me, do you hear me? Tell me what you've done with it! <clears throat> I'd say you're flogging a dead horse there. You took him down. On your own. Well done. Nice work. You surprised me. He was a mountain of a man. He was the one who attacked Neuhoff. And stole your sword, sir. The thought did cross my mind. What did he tell you? If we'd taken him alive, the executioner might have gotten more out of him. Oh well, these things happen in the heat of battle. Now, put it all behind you. A decent Christian shouldn't dwell on such horrors. I beg to differ, sir. I never want to forget this. The time has come for those whore sons to pay for what they did to us. You're right, my boy. But first, we all need some rest. I will make you pay for this. It's time for the next part of our plan. Give the word. Yes, sir. 